YouTube, this is Morgan with Guard Fight Onyx Ring. Um, this is our first video in a long time because the holidays are coming up and everyone's busy, including me, James, and Cameron. James and Cameron are here with us and we are going to give you a great video full of awesome deck profile content for the Kage Roclan. Why you gotta say it like that? The Kage. Well, I mean, I could say it like the Card Fight Online uh, commercial. No, the Kagero Clan. No, Kagero? Is that. That's how they said it in the commercial. Anyway, yeah, so mm. without further ado, we're gonna get into it. Alright, starting off with our starter, we run Dragonites today. I debated about this for a while now between him, Red Pulse, Drago Kid, and the new Undo. But I feel like this is the better option of the three because Red Pulse, Drago Kid, Counterblast 1, top 5, that's a gamble. The new Undo, Counterblast 1, put in Soul Double, it'd be a GB1 though. This way, I can this I can use early, mid, or late game whenever I want. Easy and easy to pop off. Can chain with Gatling Claw. Basically, just change your change your effect. Change yeah. your retiring. I'm going to tell you guys right now. Cameron's deck is definitely unorthodox, but I have seen it work time and time again. So don't count it out just because it's not the same that you see everywhere else. It's basically my adaptation of Hand Trap Kagura. I call it ABC Kagura. Basically, elements you're retiring, counter charging on your turn, your opponent's turn, and you're able to do stuff every turn. All right, we're starting off with one copy of Sphere Lord Dragon. Honestly, great card for Overlord deck. I'm not. I'm not sure why not people are running at least one if you're playing Overlord because Counter Blast two. Superior Call, Superior Ride of Dragonic Overlord, that being Cross, Legend, and Great if you run it. And you, and if this is in your soul, you Superior Call it to uh, open Rear Guard Circle. Two phrases, let's face it, Kyra players will never be able to use often, Superior Call and Superior Ride. And not to mention, it's GB1 skill, every time a Great 4, oh, every time your Overlord swings, it gets plus 5, so that's just an iron to haul them. Yeah. So, and everybody knows Nahalem's great. Always run that four. I like the name. Oh. Number one, and I run two Dragon Like Overlord, the Legends. Best thing that happened in the legend, the second Legend deck so far. Yeah. Basically, I use it primarily for its second skill, Counter Blast 1, Soul Blast 1, check top five for a Flame Dragon. PG, Stride Fire, and our Great Free. All good things can happen. And its, and it's first skill, GB2, Counter Blast 1, Digit Great 3, Flame Dragon. Basically, it gets plus 15, extra drive, and then a grade higher. So it becomes a grade 4. Mm -hmm. And uh, and when he swings out of rear guard, after a drive check, ditch three cards, restand. So basically, an alternate to Dauntless Drive. Yep. Except it restands. Which basically is a the theme of all the Lord decks, restands. Mm -hmm. And next, for obvious reasons, we're one, three, Dragonic Overlord, the end, and the cross. Look at that SP. Yeah, I got that one by pure luck. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah, I know, right? Basically, I keep it at a minus three because, let's face it, how often are you going to use the end skill? Yeah, the, most general. people don't let the end off. So, like, honestly, uh, cross and end are great, but only if they, you know, cross's skill is, happens way more often than end skill. So, Which, again, can trigger with today. Yeah, so. But honestly, I just use it as a quick way to get Stride Fighter, a grade three, Basically, just great, get three flame dragon resources. Recycle deck, everything like that. Oh, this deck recycles heavily. Yeah. Great so. threes. All right. Moving on to grade twos. Look at this sweet mat. Run two whole core dragons. I interrupt. Thanks, Morgan. Yeah. Basically, counter blast two. Whenever you retire something, pay the cost. You can retire something else of your choice. Again, can go off as a day. Kind of a staple for the hand trap, hand trap build that you've been seeing nowadays. Some people run at four, some people run at one, though. I think two is a modest. Two is a modest amount. And I run three Dragonic Burnouts. Again, recycling. And if I if I just choose to recycle, I can recycle. But other than that, just recycle. So last one, I can pop a unit. Yeah. We don't run the promo here. We we OG with the double rare. Always. And again, from the Legend deck, two copies of Berserk Lord Dragon. I've seen people run Neo Flame, but I prefer Berserk Lord because with Neo Flame, you got to be conscientious of where you place it on the on the map. Mm -hmm. As with Berserk Lord, swing with a Great Four, Counter Blast One, pop whatever you want. Makes sense, yeah. So with Neo Flame, you got to set the trap. Berserk Lord, I can just snipe whatever I want. Mm -hmm. 
And of course, it wouldn't be an Overlord deck if we did not run for Dragonite and Nahalom. Nahalom's a staple. Nahalom. 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 Basically, GB1, if I have an Overlord Vanguard, it gets plus 2, so it's at 11k. And a second skill, whenever my Grade 4 Vanguard swings, it gets plus 5. So right there, first try, it's going to be at 16. And if I use the Legend or the Aces skill, it's going to be at 21. So that's basically G Guardian right there. Yep. He's a powerful one. He's your, your beat stick. Always good to have. And moving on to Grade 1s. For obvious reasons, four protect orb dragons, simple unflip PG. Yeah, we don't really need to explain him. If At you, all. If you play Kagarel, this is self-explanatory. <clears throat> He's the GPG. Now this is the card which separates itself from regular hand trap Kagarel builds. I run three energy flames. A tonic. A tonic, yes. And I know what you're thinking, what the hell, but this goes off well with so many of the cards in this deck. Because when you retire something, you can activate a skill, put in salt, counter charge 2. I can't explain how many times I use this card to just have total field dominance overall. Like, at the end of a turn, I can retire three things, have all my counter blasts up, and my opponent can have all his counter blasts used. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's unorthodox, but it works. don't knock until you try it. It works. Two Lava Flow Dragons, just for Strive Fire, just for a luxury. Yeah, you're already heavy grade 3, so you don't need to run 4. And 4 of the greatest thing that happened to Overlord, as well as in the Legend Deck, Lizard General Conroe. First effect, though, when it's called, reveal grade 3, search a deck for Overlord, ditch 1. Plain and simple, just like a Strive Fire, but second effect, that's where it really comes in handy, where it shines. Retire it, whenever you swing with Overlord Vanguard, you counter charge 2. And move on to the trigger lineup. Four flame dragon heels. Again, easy grab with the legend. If you need G Guardians, yeah. Four Dragonite Janet. Basically, it goes well with the um, Dragonite Blade Master stride. Put in, when he attacks, put in salt plus five draw cards, so just more draw power. Yeah, he's the Blade Master boss crit. Just four Flame Dragon Crit Triggers, again, goes with this, and the greatest draw trigger in the game, four Gatling Claw Dragons. Snipe out those starters. Snipe out as well as I can retire two that combined with today early game, mm -hmm. if I just want total field control. Totally. And we're moving on to the G-Zone. One Vortex Dragon Desire. Basically, preferred first try. Basically, I can flip whatever I want to get to GB2 faster, and if it hits, I can retire two units, but my Vanguard's in Legion, it's going to be three. Yeah. Four Sea Breeze, because... Four Sea Breeze? One Sea Breeze. <laughs> because everybody just needs one. Yeah. Four Sea Breeze, just one sleeve. Everybody runs four Sea Breezes in this deck. What are you of talking course. about? No, everybody just needs one. And I apologize in advance, but for Dreonic Blade Master Titans, I'm getting the other two in the mail. These are just proxies right now. They're on the way. They're on the way, I promise you. Here, look at the real ones. You don't see, you don't see the other ones. There's a proxies judge. <laughs> but the only unit I have in this deck that has Blaze in it, though, but GB2, Counter Blast 1, flip up a card. I flip up a card from my G-Zone, retire any amount of units equal to the number of face-up copies of him. Mm -hmm. So for so if I G Guardian last turn, I can do this first stride. I can pop one again with Vortex. Though I can flip a copy of him in next stride. It's gonna be two, and it's second and it's and its last ability is when it's in Blazing, it gets a crit. Yep. So keep in mind in Blazing, whenever attack is launched and you have at least one more rear guard than your opponent, your Vanguard's in Blazing. So it doesn't need to be the Vanguard that attacks. It could just be an unit attacks, but the Vanguard will be emblazing. But double check though, you can't stack crits. You cannot. And next I run four of the ace. Pretty yeah, pretty much a staple in the Overlord deck though. It's first skill, counter blast two, flip up a cop flip up a copy. I forgot my own card. Yeah, counter blast two, flip over a copy of the ace though. And if you have at least two card, two face up G units, G units, it can restand 
You got to ditch an Overlord and one other card. And he loses a drive, so he only he loses gets... a drive, but it gets plus five. Yeah. So. But the amazing thing about this is the first skill, the X skill, stacks. Mm -hmm. So you have four Counter Blasts, you can flip up two copies of him, you can swing twice. Yeah. But it can't. But keep. But for the record, it cannot swing three times. It only restands once. Yeah. Um. You can counterblast. You can counterblast four and flip up two copies of him. If first, if GB two right away. If though, for some blasts. reason you need to use Ace first. Right. Yeah. So he's like uh, um, what was the the Victor first on uh, Victor Plasma? Yeah, Victor Plasma. The restrat. The restand for um, double grapplers. Ace works the same way. Right. So, but. Only as a desperation measure, if you really need to swing twice. Yeah. And of course, two Noid Express. Yeah, two uh, two two vague Express because you want to hurt people's feelings. Basically, I I only use this card if I know they have heal triggers. I want them to G Guardian. Yeah, I mean he's got the glory. He's got after five. If you're at five, five damage, damage, your triggers, triggers don't no work. Point. There's no what are triggers. Yeah. So. It's like, <laughs> or, or if you have four damage and I get a crit, you're going to regret not guarding. Yeah. And G Guardians, let's go. Three, Denial Griffin, or Exploding Chicken, if you will. Walk, walk. Basically, the only G Guardian that really doesn't need a shield because CB1, if the if our unit's a rear guard's attacking, pop it. Like, no, like, that's it. No explanation, that's if it's, it. If it's attacking, it's, it gets blown up, the attack's over. It died. Right. This chains off of Sedei, Hulk Roar, and um, Energy Flame, though. I can get all my counter, uh, counter I can counter charge all my stuff back. And it kills my quills and makes me upset. All day long. <laughs> and finally, one Defeat Flare. Yes, you only need one. Basically, when your, when your opponent's Vanguard attacks your Overlord Vanguard, CB1, bottom tech, deck 2, grade 3 Flame Dragons, not Overlords, Flame Dragons, and retire the whole back row. Let's just talk for a minute about that saucy hot stamp right there. Uh, the pure SGR? Yeah. yeah whatever. I don't First pack I pulled, pure luck. Yeah, fam. Like, he's pretty great. His his art's great. Um, and you can barely see faintly the clan symbol right there. Nice. Barely make it out. So like, he's he's great. Um, so long and short, that's ABC Cairo. I saw the hand trap cargo deck profile. Nothing wrong with it though. It's just it's the way I prefer to play it. If you don't like the way I build mine, change it. Yeah, I mean, try it, change it out. We always ex like customization is half this game. So, uh, if you like this video, like and subscribe, share it with your friends, do all that, and uh, just you know, just do it for the the Kai Senpai. All right, see you later.